How to fix SOS only on an iPhone. Welcome to another Gaging Gadgets iPhone tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to turn off or fix SOS only being displayed in the top right of your iPhone rather than your signal strength status. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and also subscribing to my channel because that really helps me out. All right, so before we get started, it's important to note that when your phone is displaying SOS only, that is it basically telling you that it is unable to connect to your wireless carrier. So there's a couple different reasons this could happen. If your phone does not have a SIM card in it, or if the SIM card is no longer functioning correctly, this would be displayed. Or it could just be that your wireless carrier is having an outage. So check the description. I'll have some links down there to some of the major carriers in the United States so you could check their system status. Now, if you have a SIM card or an eSIM in your phone, there's a couple different steps we can take that might fix this for you, including resetting your network settings. And before we do those, the first thing I would do is simply restart your iPhone. That can fix this issue for you. So try that. And if that doesn't work for you, let's open the settings on our iPhone. And the first thing we're going to do is simply scroll down and select general. Once we're in general, the first thing we're going to do is check to see if we have a carrier settings update available on our iPhone. And we can check that simply by going to about. When you go to about, if you have a carrier settings update, you'll be prompted to install the update. Go ahead and install that update, then reboot your phone. And that should fix this issue for you. Now, if you did not have an update available, let's go back to general. And what we're going to do is scroll all the way down to the bottom and select transfer or reset iPhone. Once in transfer or reset iPhone, select reset. And then in that list right there, select reset network settings. We don't need to reset the entire phone. All we need to do is reset the network settings. Go ahead and enter your passcode. And then we'll be prompted one more time to confirm that we want to reset our network settings. Keep in mind that when you reset your network settings, all of the Wi-Fi networks that you have saved on your iPhone, if they are not backed up to iCloud, they will be deleted. So if you confirm that your SIM card is working correctly and that your carrier is not having an outage, go ahead and select reset network settings. It'll reboot your iPhone. And when it restarts, hopefully the SOS issue has been fixed on your iPhone. And if all else fails and this has not fixed it for you, you definitely should contact your wireless carrier support. They should be able to fix this for you. All right, so that's how you turn off or fix SOS only on an iPhone. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more iPhone tips and tutorials, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.